What's up guys, Midugat here, and welcome back to the 5 Side series. Today we face League 2 side the Indatables. They are unbeaten in League 2 and they're a new tease, so we have no idea how good they actually are. The final game of the season, and let's have a look at the final starting lineup. Well in goal we have Michael, at the back is Martin and Byrne, Curler is in midfield, and I'm up front. We have no one on the bench today, there's no Josh or Brian today, and we're left with just 5. Luckily though, my new memory card works in the nick of time, and all 40 minutes was caught on the GoPro because we don't have a cameraman. From now on, that means I've got a fully working GoPro. It's hard though to edit GoPro footage for 40 minutes, so the highlights will be a bit short, but as of next week, everything should be back to normal. Let's get straight into this match. We're off in this friendly, Kolo with some step overs early on, hits the shot, keeper just bats it away. They're attacking down this right hand side, hit the shot, it goes over, comes back after this guy, he's going to strike on the half volley, a superb save from Michael, the rebound skied, what a save that was. The ball is with me, with a quick burst of acceleration, I'm going to run down the line, get a little bit fortunate to get back on the end of this now, as I drag it back, and the ball's going to fall to Burns, going to strike the shot, but it goes over, comes back out to Mart, and then he loses out. Kolo has a free kick for us now, in a dangerous position, Mart makes a good run, hits the shot, and somehow has skied it. That was a big chance for us, but on the other end of the pitch, this guy is going to pass the ball off to him, gets past Martin and finesses it into the bottom corner and we trail very early on. Curler on the ball, a lot of pressure on him, he somehow does get the ball away to me, he's going to hit the shot and miss it, it comes out to me in the corner, a bit of a battle going on. Ah yes, comparisons to Mkhitaryan, the Arsenal player, while wearing a Man U shirt. Alright then. Anyway, let's move on. Kohler on the ball is going to pass out wide to Martin who hits it first time into the top corner and we equalise. Kohler on the ball again, good skills to beat the defender. Good skills to beat that defender but the shot is a little bit weak as the keeper makes a decent save. This man has the ball at the back and I've tackled him and this is a huge chance. Drag the shot just wide, what a chance. There's a bit of a battle going on out wide. Can't really see what's happened but the referee saw something and he's given us a penalty. At one all in this game, just under 10 minutes we've got a penalty. Let's have a replay. Yet yeah, the guy who has touched the ball inside the box will have to screenshot just to prove it. Kohler steps up to put us 2 1 up, which he does calmly and collectively. We are 2 1 up. This guy on the ball has a shot from distance, it drags wide. Come back out to me. A fake shot to beat the defender. I'll go through, but the shot has been scuffed and it has gone over. Comes back out for Martin, who hits it first time, and that's horrendous. Free kick to be taken by them. I'm going to come in and intercept it. 1 1 for the goalkeeper. Can I score this time? Yes, I can, and we are 3 1 up. Here come the Indatables, looking to get himself back in it. Good ball across, not being marked, posting in, and they're backing it at 3-2. Curler on the ball out wide, sends this defender onto the floor. Does manage to get the shot away, but it's a good save from the keeper. Curler on the ball, loses out in a dangerous position. They manage to get the shot away, but Burn gets a foot in there and he deflects it over. Some nice football from the Indatables. A nice one too to get around Martin and a lovely finish to level it all up at 3 all. The ball's played out wide to Burn, who hits the shot and fucks up the GoPro. Luckily, I can sort it. This ball's played all the way through. This guy's going to hit the shot, goes over. Burn go play it back into Michael. And oh my god, we're 4-3 down somehow, that has got in. We need something before half time, as Kohler gets the ball into me. I hit it first time, narrowly goes wide, try it on my left foot, and that's back to me being one star weak foot. Kohler plays a nice ball up, me and Martin both running at it. Martin gets there first, passes it to me, me back to Martin, Martin to Burn. He manages to get a shot away and it's a good save from the keeper. I missed out the half time whistle. This ball across the pitch is quite poor, I'm going to intercept it, it bounces, it hits it on the half volley, keeper tips over, comes back out to Kola, who hits it with his left foot, but keeper just stands firm to make the save. Kola on the ball, plays into me, I play into Michael, who looks up and plays into Kola, who plays out to Burn. nice passing football, he strikes it, it goes wide, comes out to me, outside of the foot shot, and it's a brilliant save from the goalkeeper. Michael on a free kick, plays it to Burn, who plays it back to Michael, Michael holds onto it, he looks at Kola, who's out wide, Kola takes a touch, gets onto his right foot, toe pokes it in, and we now are back level. Kola feeds it through to Michael, we're on the attack. He hits the shot and it just goes wide. This guy gets ahead for me, takes it around me, and now goes up on the charge on the pitch. It's a good counter attack, posting in, and we trail 5 4. There on the ball, it's a poor ball straight to Kolo. He's got one defender to beat. He does it brilliantly, sends the goalkeeper with a fake shot, rolls into the empty net, and it's level again. Kolo on the ball loses out. This guy just smashes it at me, you know, just standard human behaviour. As Kolo and me play a 1 2, it comes off the wall, comes back out to Kolo, gets onto his left foot, and skies it. Comes out to Bird, who just volleys it first time. A lovely goal as we take the lead 6 5. Kolo on the ball again, making everything happen as he gives it to Byrne, who completely has scoffed his shot as it goes wide. Comes out to Kola, who taps it off the wall, gets back onto it, takes a touch, rolls it into the net, 7-5. Lovely goal. Kola has the ball in the corner, gets past the defender and beats this defender with lovely bit of skill. 1-1 one -one for the goalkeeper, but he sticks his leg out and makes a very good save. Loose ball, bounces out wide, Michael's going to battle with this guy, and it's a bit of a battle going on. He gets past Michael, hits a shot, he goes in at Martin's near post, he's in goal for Michael if you haven't noticed, and with 7-6 up though still. Michael has the ball deep, he plays into Kola, who plays it back out to Michael, who finds me in some spaces. I hit the shot first time and the keeper easily holds on to 
into it. Burn is in goal for Martin now as this guy is tackled by Kola who was not even moving. That's just poor from that guy. He drags his shot wide and it's going to come back out to me. I've got a man on, so I'm going to smash it off the wall. Comes back across to the defender, who loses out, and it comes to Martin, who plays into Kola. He's going to go for the back heel shot. Simple save to make for the keeper. Martin on the ball, looks up and plays into me. I take one touch and just scoop it back into his path, but he gets a shot away and drags it wide. Just going to clear up. We've been told it's 7 all at this point, so we think it's basically a late goal will win this game for us. And we're actually 7-6 up, so just bear that bit in mind as Michael makes this save. Kola is holding onto the ball out wide, got a lot of pressure. He looks up, he has got burn to one side, gives it to burn. He takes a touch, looks up, hits a shot from distance. It has gone in. We go 8-6 up. We think we've gone 8-7 up though. 8-6, they think it's 8-7 to us. This guy looks up, plays a brilliant pass across, and they have made it 8-7. They have got a chance in this game once more. Not long to go at all in this game. Kola gives that wide to burn. He plays it across to me, and I'll just get the shot away, and it's a good save from the keeper as it's played through. Now there's a counter attack. Now they can level it up. Oh, they kind of hit the shot. Michael makes a very good save. He throws it back out to Kola. This is a tense finish to the match. He's got me to one side, Burn to the other. He looks up. He gives it out wide to Burn, who hits the shot, and that should have been a chance to put this game to bed. And it's still 8 7. They go on the counter attack. It's a 3v1. They go through, hit the shot. They think they've took the lead. They have actually equalised. An absolute late scenes as it's now 8 all in this game, and they think they're 9 8 up. And unfortunately for us, that was the last attack of the game as the full time whistle blows. So after believing all week we lost, we in fact drew and somehow the ref got the score wrong. The match didn't matter as it was a friendly, but I'm shocked. I checked three times to make sure and I can guarantee we drew. Let's have a look at the league table though. We finished third in the league as Benno Blues have lost to Robin Hood. Mina with the second best team, I'm not sure if we'll get promoted or not. But no matter if we do or not, next season has to be better no matter what league we're in because we've been poor this season for the majority of it. We'll just leave this season into the past and we'll move on and do much better next season. If you have enjoyed this video and this season, drop a like on the video, subscribe if you're new around here. Next Friday should be the end of season special actually no not next friday the friday after so just before the second match day of next season comes out we will have the end of season special thank you for watching see ya